Thank you for enjoying this course with me on building a website to make for sale on Flippa, listing it on Flippa, and then getting it sold on Flippa. Here's what we've talked about with the most important points. The first point is to choose a website format that works for you that's easy enough to build. If you've already got a website, you might not have even looked at this section. The only thing you want to make sure you remember from this section is the emphasis on setting up a website that makes money. If you ultimately want to sell a website, you absolutely need to show some clear way on it to potential buyers that it makes money. So even if you have a successful website, the lecture on making money on your website is helpful. In section three, we covered listing your website on Flippa. Overview in the beginning of every single part of the process to sell so it's not quite so scary. Handling the key issue of pricing. You set your price low, such as a dollar to get started. You set your reserve price as low as you can possibly stand to sell it for, which might be $100, $500, 1000 etc. You get your website verified on Google Analytics because that's the 80-20 part of sales on Flippa. Only 20% of websites are verified through Google Analytics and even less are verified with AdSense revenue. Even if your AdSense revenue is low, you still want to go through and verify it. The seller's notes is where you can really convert bids and close your sale. You want to write them short and be very specific about what you're offering for sale. Then in the financials, you want to clearly communicate the money you're making, especially if it's a service-based website. Finally, you want to convert your sale by directly reaching out to your potential buyers with a clever sales message, often a message that's just more practical, such as, hey, I won't be available at this domain anymore because I'm selling it. Here's the new one I'll be at. Oh, and here's a link to my Flippo sale. Then you engage with every single buyer because you don't know who's going to be your power buyer. But if you engage and comment and answer questions really well, you can be certain that you'll provide a good experience for potential buyers and then you'll have a great chance to get an auction that sells well. Finally, you want to complete the sale successfully with trust and gratitude with the potential buyer, especially once they've paid the money on escrow. You want to work to do everything in your power to make sure the sale gets completed and that you offer nothing except trust and gratitude on your end to the buyer while maintaining exactly for sale what you said you'd sell in the seller's notes. You can wrap all of this up then by analyzing your ROI and selling your website. Did you actually make good money selling your website or did you effectively work a low paying job to get your website sold? When you know how much money you made per hour selling your website, you can decide is this worth doing better and then when you keep doing it better, you can more than likely do it faster and make more money out of it. I'm honored you've taken the time and energy in this course with me. And what I would love for you to do, if you've been inspired on this course, please click on here to write a review and just leave a five-star review at a minimum if that's how you feel. Or you can even write a very detailed review so that other people can get the value out of this course you've got out of it. If you don't think this deserves a five-star review, then I need to know why so that I can make this course better. If this course isn't good enough for five stars, I will do whatever it takes to get it there, and you can tell me exactly what I need to do in the discussion. I'm grateful in my other courses I've got excellent discussions posted that have helped me take my three and four star courses into five star courses. And that's exactly what I'd love to hear from you. Even if you do think it's five stars and you review it, I'd love to get more feedback on what you think I could add to this course, what you think I could do to make it better. You can just simply type a discussion in here with any title and then go into details. Another discussion you can add that would be really good for other students is if you get your website sold, if you get your website sold or something like this on Flippa, here's what you can do. You can take a quick little screenshot of it. You can go in here and save it in any old folder. You quickly go back. You hit the upload a file 
and I'll go over to the flip a course. I put my file in here. So now you can see exactly what you can do in the discussions that can be inspirational to other students. When you post that your website got sold on Flippa, you can inspire other students who are taking the course to say, you know what? If this other student was able to do this, then I can probably do this too. It's one thing for me as the instructor to do anything, but other students, you are in the best position to motivate another student. So I hope you will make good use in this course of these three functions. The review function, if you love the course and think other students should know it. The discussion function, if you have tips that you think I can use to make the course better, or if I haven't done something well that you want to vent about and tell me I need to fix, I will respond to it and I will fix it. And then the image function in the discussion to share any screenshots you have of sales you make on Flippa after you've enrolled in this course. Thank you very much for taking this course with me. I am honored that you've spent your time in this course and I'm working hard in all of my courses to give you the very best of what I've learned online, honestly and completely. All of these courses I'm teaching now help you get the best out of what you're doing and learning online. And this is my newest course you've just enrolled in at the time of making this, January 2nd, 2015. I am honored you've spent this time with me and I hope to continue sharing what I know with you in this course or another course. Thank you.